Hi there. In this video, we'll be going through a quick information about how to navigate information on our Click Analytics website. When you log into Click Analytics website, you will see this screen. The screen is divided into two main parts. You have a top menu, and then you have a left-hand side menu. This is how we organize all the different various apps that we have in our system. The top menu resembles all the main apps pertaining to each asset class. For example, markets will give you all the main application that is for multi-asset class level. The stocks will give you all the apps that is related to stocks so that we have funds, commodities, FX, cryptocurrency, Kami, and you have a company symbol. You have tools related to all the main tools that we have over here, like chart, screener, market events, correlation, formulas, watch list. Followed by that we have all the major news that is appearing over here. Then you have a My Link over here, which gives you all the information pertaining to your own preferences, your charts, watch list, and much more. And then last but not least, you have a support dropdown. This is where you can get access to our help menu over here. And you can also see what are the new updates that we have in our system and much more. Now, in order to search a particular symbol on the top left-hand side, you have this input box. This is where you can simply type the name of the ticker or symbol that you're looking for. For example, if I were to look at Tesla, I can just type Tesla, and this will give you an autocomplete over here. And this shows that this is a Tesla, and the code is TSLA. And this will appear over here straight away. Now, if you notice that the moment we supply information on the search bar, the left menu gets changed. The left menu over here gives you all the various apps that we have pertaining to Tesla. So this gives you a quick summary information. And whenever we, there is an app is selected, you will see the selection is highlighted with a orange color over here. So for example, if I were to go to performance app, this will be selected and loaded over here. And on the right hand side, you will see all the data over here. Now, if we have a more than one information about an app, we further organize that into tabs. And this is where you will see these tabs coming up. So within the performance, we have a performance tab. We have historical trends. So if you're looking for a historical performances, this will be appearing over here. So simply select the tabs of your choice, and this will give you all the information related to that particular ticker or symbol accordingly. So this is a very simple way to access all this information. Now, if I were to go back to any of the app of my choice of any asset class, I can just hover on my mouse over here. So for example, if I were to go and look at all the seasonality of stocks over here, this will be run over here. For you to navigate to any of the apps very quickly is, you can select the top menu over here, select any application of your choice, and this will be appearing over here. Okay, to summarize how to navigate on Click Analytics, you have the top input box, which is for us to search for any symbols. You can search symbols, common stocks, ETFs, mutual funds, currencies, commodities, everything, because we are a multi-asset class platform. Second way is you can use the top menu over here, which is organize all the application based on their own asset classes over here. And you can look at and launch an application of your choice over here. The left menu also help you to further drill down the apps for that particular asset class. So we, since I am in markets over here, I can see that how, what are the other application that we have pertaining to market asset class. So I can always go to performances over here, or I can go to Teams over here, and this will represent all the, the particular app based on market asset class. We are a multi-asset class platform. That's why we organize all this information into our top menu and the left-hand side menu. Also, you have the full capability to directly look at a particular ticker and goes and look at information directly over here. 